After eons of tyranny, the demon god Adir was finally overthrown by humanity. Though fear of his terrible power endured. And so was formed the hallowed sentinels. Our duty being to stand vigil for signs of his return. Even exile to another realm could not silence the fallen god forever. And in time, Adir's malignant influence pervaded the world once more. In his hunger for vengeance, Adir orchestrated the return of his demonic army. Light was swallowed by shadow. And with it, hope. A new, grim champion arises. The Dark Crusader. And perhaps it will indeed come to pass that only they who shun the light in order to fight the darkness possess the power to defy a god. Oh snap. Hey guys, it's Boy Prof here. Um, I thought, you know what? I've got this game on my Steam. I've had it for a while now. And I'm gonna I'm gonna actually play it, so it's my gonna be my first ever sort of playthrough of this game. It's a bit as well, I was thinking about cracking on with that. Uh, I've, I think I've only played the old old Lords of Fallen about three, four hours. Uh, let's keep that as 50. Uh, you have... Oh, no, oh, okay. Contrast, brightness. Keep that as 50. What's the saturation? Oh, wow, that is... Really saturated. Let's just keep that as actually. I quite I on sixty maybe. A bit of brightness. See what that looks like. Uh, no, let's keep it as fifty. I don't want to mess with it and have it actually look horrible at the same time. All right, guys, we're back again. And yeah, I don't know what happened there. The game sort of crashed on me. No idea why that happened. Uh, for some unknown reason. I'm going to leave this just out of shy. So we've got the Dark Crusader starting class unlocked. You now have access to Dark Crusader starting class for every new game you begin. This offers a unique set of gear tailored for long sword place player style. In light we walk. Okay, you have now access to this exclusive set. Okay, you now have access to set of consumable uh, starting boost unlocked. No idea. Yep. I like that. unlimited. Why not? Uh, actually, uh, for more consistent frame rate or higher, your best experience faster. 
machines. Uh, you may need to play VCs to reach higher frame rates. Uh, let's do performance. Oh. No. Uh. Uh, we got performance down. Graphics, apply changes. There we go. Custom. Where was custom again? Auto set or make fit graphics is based on watch benchmark of hardware. That's great. Okay. Don't know what I don't know what's happening there. I'm just trying to change it. Uh Auto set. Whoa. Okay. Why is that on low? Motion blur off umbral distortion effect. Yeah, why not? Okay, let's go for sound. Uh, let's do that to eighty. That eighty for that one. Music. About 86 for that one. Voice, 100%. Voice. Okay, right. Ba -da 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 -da. So these are controls, blah, blah. Gestures, range, light attack, blah, 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 blah. Knock on, dodge, interact, lamp, jump, switch stance. X, use item, light attack, heavy attack, makes sense, block, and lantern range. Okay, nice. Let's go! Boris, forgive me. I'd steer this weapon of deliverance to a worthier servant than I.
Oh, damn. Just beheaded straight away. Whoa. Okay, so now we can choose the Hollowed Knight. Uh, and then we've got the plants team, so what do you have? Strength, Fragility, Endurance, Vitality, Radiance, Inferno, okay. Black Feather Ranger, Exiled Stalker. That looks pretty cool, that. I like that. That does look pretty cool, actually. Uh, let's look at the Condemned, which basically is nothing. Wow. i got to admit, that looks nice. Just... Ragged chains on the on the ankles, chains around the wrist. Pick out, I love that. A wretched prisoner who has suffered indescribable torments, whether there be any truth in their guilt or not. A class for those who would rage at fate and throttle adversity with unflinching, blood-soaked hands. Pick at your own risk. I like that. Some of wow. Okay, he looks cool. Oh, that does look really cool, actually. Um, oh, I don't know who to... That just reminds me of Bloodborne. Just straight away, it reminds me of Bloodborne, just because of the cap. Uh, who to pick? So, you got a bit more agility. Ooh. Wolf, which is strength, so you're just basically Unga Bunga. You literally are just Unga Bunga style. You're a bit of a mixed, a paladin of Dark Crusade, an elite military order in the service of the Church of Orion. Radiance, spreading the te te teachings of the Church and Orion's fire, whatever means necessary. Physically powerful class, suitable for those who have favour or more aggressive approach. I do quite like that, to be honest. Um, considering never really, ah, uh, considering the fact this is this is the Zach's first playthrough, maybe the next one I'll probably start. I like I I do like to in like sort of soul genre games start with basically. Nothing. The Condemned, uh, Dark Souls, uh, I forgot where you are. Whereas basically your stats are all the same there. Basically, you can just work your way up from there. you got a bucket as your weapon, I think. Which is pretty funny. <laughs> uh, I don't know who to exactly pick. The pirate cult is favourite worship of the deer who saw the natural order are finally restored and humanity, one true god, returned to its rightful place as their ruler, a high risk class re relying on proficiency in inferno. Uh, you know what? We're gonna go for Dark Crusader. Because they just look cool. Sort of paladin looking bloke. Oh, god, what happened there? Oh no. Wait, what? I don't even know what button I pressed. Oh my god. Right. Dark Crusader. Go for next. Ooh, one scary looking dude. Head B. No. What sort of looks like me? Uh, that in a way. 
Uh, no. Well, no. Sort of. Uh, sort of my hair in a way. That's closer. That is more legitimately my hair. Just imagine it a bit longer. Facial hair. I do have a full on mosaic beard going on. No, 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 no. Sort of beard I'm going for. Let's go for tattoos. Can't see anything along the nose, to be honest. Oh, he's in his boxes. Hello there. Uh, right cheek. Which is, to be honest, covered up. So, we're going to keep you as... None. Mouth. Can you use that? No. These are sort of blemishes. There's like a little mark on there. Ooh. Yeah. Well, I am pretty um tubby at the moment, so we'll go for... Let's go for a sort of... Well, I'm not that tubby, actually, to be honest. Uh, let's go for you. Yep, tattoos. Let's have a look. Quite like that, actually. Do 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 do. Ah, yeah, that's pretty cool. Just cover him in absolute ink. Right arm's sort of the same. I call it that. Uh, let's keep that as that. Oh, so we can check. Okay. Right, sound. Uh, change set colors. Um, see what that looks like. Actually, yeah, we'll go for... Go for purple. Saturation. Brightness. Oh. Uh, yeah. Uh, Dark Crusader changed name. Oh my god, I can't spell. That's how I spell my name? Yeah. Alright. So this is our dude. Sort of paladin looking guy. Maybe on my next playthrough I'll probably do... Um... Uh... Law. The latest receiver of his grace. Great potential dwells within you, doubtless, for you to be chosen thusly. And so does Aureus wisdom guide my hand in the bestowment of this subsequent boon. Your flesh has been made sacrosanct with the mark of the Dark Crusaders. Prove yourself worthy of this gift. Seek me in the bowels of the bridge. Our work is of the greatest import.
Oh, damn it. Now I wish I went for the condemned and start from scratch. I do like the armor. I do like the armor and the way it looks, actually. It looks really cool. So. Oh, no. Has to move. Right, let's change stance. Okay. So, that's the bar and everything. Let's go back. Okay, let's change stance to one handed. Back. Okay, that's a quick swing. Quick swing. Boom. One handed. Just like whackity whack, 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 whack. Love it. So that's the guard. That's the parry. Oh, I'm running and jump in this game. It's awesome. Okay, so that's. What that looks like. Quickly go in there, get this. I'm over the bigger skull. Okay. Not too bad. Health. Uh, press on, oh, lock on target. Nice, nice. See what this looks like in the umbra. Whoa. So that's nothing, and then. Boom. Someone screaming, holding up. What do you look like? <gasps> screamy, screamy face. Oh my god. Okay, I see I'm gonna like this game a lot. It's beautifully done though. I'll give it that. Uh, I didn't miss anything down here, did I? Can I go through here? No. Nope. Alright, sound. Uh, while moving, sprint. No, it could just destroy that. Actually, can I not just jump down? I nearly missed that completely. Well, not on the target, but just quickly dashing at me, uh, double tap and roll out of danger. <laughs> One swipe, whack. Skardoosh. Mine of fire salts. Okay, okay. Oh, bit of drop right there. Open infantry, blah, blah, blah. Assault modifier, quick available gear. That's a throwing rock. Nothing. Uh... Oh, okay. Now I'm in the umbral. Didn't even realize you could do that at this precise moment. There's a bit of lag here and there. Range combat. Okay. Ow. Pressing wrong buttons. I was pressing X. Like a bloody numpty. Okay, so this is where we can exit, emerge from the umbra.
Must indicate plus interest. Ah, the old seeing eye, I see. That's full health. Hi. Does it follow the roots, possibly? Roots go all the way through there. Through there. Right, take you out. Have you dropped anything? Nope. Press LB and R2 to simultaneously perform multi-hit hack. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, so, that's where that goes. Attack combinations. All attacks, blah, blah, blah. Uh, additionally, mini stances can be inverted. Yep. Nice. Ow. Wrong button again. One. Two. Where is... So that loops... Oh my god, this loops round. All the way through here. Uh, Sangreus is primary healing tool. Yeah. Other consumables. Yeah. Okay. So, where is... Uh, Rift by Holden. Uh, 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 uh. Ow. Okay, one second. Let's get into the umbral. Let's get our stuff from here. Withered ward. Soul flay. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Okay, so that's got rid of that then. What's down here? Soft lane enemies, uh, okay. No. Okay. Look on to me and I'm going to when the enemy is fully withered, and zombie to tear out their soul. Okay, I'm gonna have to try that. Yank. Any more? Uh, siphoning. To recover soul free charges. Okay, so I've got one soul flay charge. Uh, with our... Ouch. Okay. No, wrong button. Wrong button. I keep pressing the wrong goddamn button, for God's sake. Uh, I keep pressing X. With that help comes recovery to damaging enemies. Oh, okay. See how far this reaches. Oops. 
Maybe we can give me some marketing back. No. I like the swings, to be fairly honest. Swing's quite nice. What's, what are you? Ah. Uh, sanity Quinn something. Okay, so I can gain that back. Still don't understand it. Perfectly honest. While falling uh to press No, wrong goddamn button again. So these are the little faceless things that are just weird. Uh, and when an enemy is soft laid, they can be pushed in any direction. Oh. That's quite interesting, actually. Quite like that. Dread. Prolonged periods and umble make your presence increasingly known to its inhabitants. The longer you spend an umble, the more dangerous to beings who who hunt you. Ah, so that, oh, I keep pressing goddamn X. That's gonna annoy me. Okay, I'm out of stamina. Hey, that's not nice. At all. Prolonged periods and umble. Yeah, that makes sense. I don't know. I like the the, the long sword. Maybe uh, it's quite nice. Uh, so this is the other so now that door should be open to us as it looks so I could exit the humble realm now which would be quite nice to do uh, I don't want to particularly jump okay hi no there was something here That appeared and then disappeared. What weirdness. What weirdness is... Hi. I could have kicked him. So, fire. That is the kick. Here is the door. Abandoned red scope. That is beautiful. Oh look, vestiges, okay, that's where the previous lamp bearers fell, so now we could rest, which I'm going to do, straight away, I ain't going to mess around, because now we've got all that back, pick that up, tactics journal, map and warnstead, what, can we actually look at the map, warnstead, okay, so that's the map okay it's not exactly a map map but yeah uh, so let's have a look at our equipment so we've got a wooden wait wait wait, wait. no 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 paladin i um paladin isaac's sword okay so what are you scaled to Scale to strength C. That's why we got strength. Okay. And then obviously wooden cross. Which is that. Parchment. Uh, script covered strips of parchment which explode upon imp. Excuse me. And they do 115 holy damage. Okay. So this is the route it seems that we're probably going to go down 
with a block. In all honesty, I might do a uh, shield as well. Considering we don't have a shield, it'd be quite nice to do a shield. And wrong button. Oh my god, he just... Ow! Well, that hurt. Oh my god, that reach. Should have missed. Oh. How did he get me from there? Mm. Right, I need to recover stamina. Go on, bait, bait and attack. No. Nice. Yes. Get in there. Oh, great. Ew. Oh, we get to fight the boss man. Straight away. I kind of wanted to avoid that, but it's kind of typical you fight the main boss guy straight away. That lamp. No, it's my lamp. Get your own lamp. You get it from B&M and Lidl and Aldi. Ouch. Right, where's he going from? Where's he coming from? There he is. Boom. Nice. Miss me, miss me. Now you gotta kiss me. Gain some. Straight away. Just landed on me. Killed me. And I get a second chance. Miss me. Oh, God, I'm getting hit. Hi. No. Come, bring it. Bring it. The light reaper. Whoa. I was not expecting that. Well, you're just cheeky, ain't you? Okay. I think that was well it's obviously supposed to happen you're supposed to die to him but I was expecting to get at least a hit on him at least figure recovered yep but we killed that that, that little first boss which is kind of really easy lost and found retrieve vigor lost upon death makes sort of sense to get an achievement from that. Thank you. It's not like Dark Souls 2 where it's like, welcome to Souls. Where you die straight away. Uh, I normally get that achievement done straight away. When I, first, when I first played Dark Souls 2, I snapped the disc. I think I, I think it was years ago, back on the Xbox 360, I just fully snapped the disc. My mate told me to get it. And the guy was... Um, <laughs> The guy at CEX was like, are you sure you want to get this? Are you sure? Like, are you 100% sure you want to get this game? And I was like, yeah. And my mate was like, yeah, it's a good game. It's a good game. Within 20 minutes, I snapped the disc. 
I was like, no, I've had enough of this game. This game is crap. This game is too hard. Bearing in mind, I was... I don't even know how young I was, but I was quite young. Ah, that's to get up there and go further that way. There is someone there. Uh, sometimes I'm off indicate. Yep, yep, yep. So, but we can go that way. Uh, what is it in Dark Souls 2? Where you first start, obviously, you drop. You fall to the, the depths. So that's a door that we probably can't even get through. Not too sure. Let's have a look. Yeah, the gate does not budge. That makes perfect sense. Uh, and instead of going to, like, the three witches first, um, you uh, turn... What's it? You turn, like, you turn left just before the house. And uh, you got the little, like, frost faced troll giant sort of looking guy, and you fight him. I always wondered if there were others. You're probably thinking that lamp's just a tool to be used as you see fit. Take it lightly, and you'll find it's the other way around. Mark my words. Is that it? I don't know who you are, and I don't care. The Iron Wayfarer. It seems a deer has you marked, making you a bigger threat to the Rogar serves us both. I've defied the wills of gods and kings. If you know any kind of freedom, you'll do the same. I've defied if you know any I've one more time defied. if you know okay you you that 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 is that it my friend thank you no can't go that way why do you look like I can there you go I thought that was a vestige uh can upgrade character um considering uh I'm going to leave it for now. Not too sure. Even though I've really got into strength. Uh, wait. Uh, so I'm going to raise it a rift. I'm going to transfer to humble. Then lock. Okay. And then reveal the fragment. Wow. Okay, that's pretty awesome. Hi. And wrong button. Uh, I kick you, then I slice you. Well, I was waiting for my stamina to regen, mate. Thank you. Uh, nope, you're, you're you're actually dead. I just see him moving a little bit, and I was like, "Are you alive?" What did we get minor ho holy salts. That's where we were. That's where we were as well. Um, I'm not too sure. I think I'm just going to keep up the Unga Bunga style, like the dual hand. Uh, the dual hand, maybe. There we go. Nice, nice. Who are you? Okay. Why does this look like a mixture of an ambushy? Hmm. 
Nice. I knew it. Hi. Let's collect you. One, one seventeen, one eighteen. There's a dude up there. I'm just assuming there's a dude up there. Okay, right. So, how do? Why does it look like some certain stuff is gonna happen? Oh, where the hell did you come from? That terrified me. Ho 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 ho! Wow. Oh, big boy. Anything else around here? How the hell did he reach me? Who are you attacking, mate? Can you see him? In all honesty, I think he's attacking me. Is there a ladder? Yeah, there is. Right. Go up the ladder. Say hi to him. Thank you, iframes. Love it. Uh, he's there. No, it's up. Then X and RT. Okay. So that's how you do that. And that's where we pick up that. 116, 117, 118. Okay. So killed you. Anybody else that wants to say hello? Just you. Okay. Hi. Oh my god. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, so he yanked him over there. Okay, he does his fiery stuff. Oh my god. Wow. You hit hard, mate. Right, keep an eye on for you. Right. I am going to take him out. Whoa. Knew there was another guy there. Now I'm fighting two of them. Okay. Okay. Right. Take you out. Come on then. Bring it. Oh. Wow. Go on in. Ooh. No! We should go into Umbral. I say we should. There we go. Boom. Done him. What do we get? Select garb. Okay. Uh... So just that guy there he goes through there. Anything around here? Nope. Nope. Something up there, probably. I need to find out where them red things go, the red butterflies. Uh, nope. Uh, nope. Uh, there it is. 
Then it's that. Okay. Drops you down there. Drops you around there. So we've done up there. We've done around. We haven't done here yet. So. Ow. That hurts. Right. That's a no. Leave me alone. Pick up. What did we get? Engraved figure skull. Uh, small monsters. So engraved figure skull. Raw mangler axe. Okay. Okay. Seems like we're picking up a few goodies here. I think that's everything. Uh, I'm not too sure. So obviously it's like a parallel university umbral, so stuff will be unlocked. That's normally not unlocked in without in the Makes sense. You're there. Anyone else? You're a no, you're a no. Do it. You Pick you up. Ammunitions. That seems okay. Round here. Oh, hi. Hi. So, I think we've actually cleared this whole area. Let me get this, uh, the thing that we dropped. So, what was it? It was Orion Preacher Shield. I did say we needed a shield, to be perfectly honest. Ouch. Like the little nubby shield. Uh, okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to return from the umbral before we get whacked up. There we go. Okay. Right. Then this. Oh, hi. I have no idea what to... fire ward. Huh. Okay, I haven't got him yet. Oh, there's a vestige. Uh. Physical power, which will be quite nice. Gets our stamina up, agility, which one is vitality, is our health, which also increases our weight, which is quite nice. That yeah, increases our mana. That also increases our mana. Endurance, obviously. As our agility is our just resistance. Um, that goes up by three. That goes up by one, by one, by one. Uh, we could just do strength. Yeah, why not? Go for strength. We're making it unga bunga bunga style. Uh, we do have an axe, which is for. C Inferno, which is a raw mangler, which is does four fire, broken sword. Okay. So that will be it for this episode, guys. Uh I do hope you have enjoyed this first episode of Lords of the Fallen. I'm sort of really enjoying it actually. It's quite nice. Um to see where everything goes. Uh to see how it all goes. We did rest, didn't we? Um Let's have a little rest. Uh, but yeah, please like, subscribe, and uh, do, 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 do. I, I, uh, I will continue this episode if it gets, I don't know, two likes. Uh, just wanted to see how everyone gauged it, gauges this game. 
staggering and backstabbing. Uh, there we go. Boom. Well, you oppose no threat to me, it's any gym. Uh, let's pick you up. Well, once completed, a stack of blah, 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 blah. Okay, so we got unique berries. This just reminds me of Dark Souls 1. Ring the bells of awakening. That is literally further down here. Okay, okay, that, that, okay that's a little bridge where we can go around the other side. I am in love with that umbral because it just unlocks more to it, which is actually really nice. Uh... Yeah, so uh, if this video reaches um, two, two, maybe three likes, uh, I'll continue with these playthrough or let's play or gameplay. It's just me playing a game. Uh, if you like what you see, like, subscribe. Like I said, three likes and I'll continue this series. Uh, we know we got enshrouded as well. Uh, I'm... So yeah, I hope to see you guys on the next one. All right, sweet.